good morning from me and my amazing sunrise. I actually am on my way home from the gym. So Julia texted me this morning, that's my boot camp instructor, about four and let me know that she was sick and wasn't going to be able to make boot camp. So I told her that I'll just go ahead and go to the gym if she wasn't gonna be at boot camp. It's really hard to do our workout without her because she has the music, she has what we're supposed to be doing for our workout. So I ended up walking to the gym, doing my train well workout, which I got a new workout. Whew, girl, I am sweaty, hot, tired. My arms feel like jello. <laughs> it was a back and bicep workout and it was hard, but it was really, really good. Like I feel really good after my workout. So I did that and now I am actually walking home. It's a super beautiful morning. It's such a beautiful morning here. It's like 72 degrees. There's a little bit of a breeze. It's beautiful. I did have my protein coffee this morning. I got up pretty early and in anticipation of going to boot camp. So I had my protein coffee before I went to the gym. I'm gonna go home, mix up my creatine, and I'll sip on that while I get ready for the day. And then we'll take the rest of my supplements and have some breakfast. But I'm really proud of myself that even though my schedule was thrown off and boot camp was canceled, I still did my workout, got in a killer workout, I'm sweaty. I'm tired, but I'm feeling really good. So a little OOTD outfit of the day. I actually just got this set off of Amazon. I'll actually share a little Amazon clothing haul with you. I picked up a few pieces for my upcoming trip. The day you see this video, I'm actually flying out to Spokane for my 30 year high school reunion. So I got a couple of pieces for that. And just a couple things that were on a really, that I really wanted to add to my wardrobe. Sorry if you hear the leaf blower. We actually have a guy coming out to do some fix it, to fix up our sprinkler system our drip system, we're having an issue with it working at all. I think a solenoid needs replaced. So Troy's out picking up the dog poop and he's obsessed with the leaf blower. So sorry if you hear that, but I am going to make some breakfast. Since I am leaving Wednesday, I'm actually going to head to the grocery store really quick this morning to pick up some groceries to have on hand when I get back from my trip and then to make sure that Troy has what he needs while I'm gone. We're gonna make a super quick grocery run, but for breakfast this morning, I'm pretty hungry from my workout. I'm going to make a breakfast sandwich. It's just it keeps me full with the carbs, the protein, the fat. So we're gonna do just a regular Thomas English muffin, a slice of Sargento pepper jack cheese, one egg, and one of the Applegate Naturals chicken maple sausage. And I make that into just this really delicious breakfast sandwich. I like the sweet of the sausage and the spicy of the pepper jack together. Super good. And then I actually have some leftover blueberries and cut up strawberries from my boot camp pool day. And I'm going to eat those up. I just don't want them to go bad. I made a trifle and this is what was left over fruit wise. So let me put together my breakfast. All right, so here's my breakfast, my breakfast sandwich. One one egg, one slice of pepper jack cheese, the sausage patty, some strawberries and some blueberries. I have half of a cup total. I'm telling you this breakfast is so filling. Fiber, carbs, protein, healthy fat, it's a winner. So now that I finished breakfast, it's time to take my supplements for the day. I took my multivitamin, my probiotic, and now I'm going to take my Bellway Super Fiber Gummies. I never take my gummies prior to working out, especially when I go to boot camp and I'm outside and there's no bathroom. Even on days I go to the gym, I prefer to take them once I get home, either before breakfast or after breakfast. Take two Bellway Fiber Gummies at least four days a week. I'm going to take these with me when I head to Spokane. They're a staple for me. They're absolutely delicious and they're going to give me four grams of fiber. Raspberry lemon flavor, organic, no added sugar, which I very much appreciate. Most gummies have so much sugar in them. That's why I never take them. And the Bellway has zero added sugar and they taste amazing. They're actually sweetened naturally with stevia. You can see they look like little raspberries. They're the perfect gummy texture. They're sweet, like they're sweetened with sugar, but they're not. They're absolutely amazing and they're extremely, extremely effective. Not only will they help you get in your fiber for the day, but they also help keep you regular, which is the main reason that I take them. When you eat a high protein diet, you can often have issues in that area and the fiber gummies definitely help. And like I said, they taste amazing, incredible ingredients and no added sugar. They're made with prebiotic fiber, so it's incredibly good for your gut and gut health. If your gut health is not in check, it is very, very hard to lose weight. It's You'll see a lot more weight fluctuations. You'll have a lot of discomfort and Bellway helps with all of that. So I actually have a 20 25% off discount for your first order. I'll link it down below for you, but I highly, highly recommend. So the landscapers are here and I think it's time for a special bone. 
Should we do a special bone while the landscapers are here? So we've switched our special bones a little bit. Lola now gets these dream bones. They're sweet potato because she has to watch her protein intake. And then Palmer gets the traditional smart bones. I buy both of these on Amazon. I'll link them for you. For you, good boy. Maybe easy nuggy. There you go, baby, good girl. All right, we are headed to the grocery store. I'm just gonna go to Fry's. It's five minutes from my house. I'm in, I'm out. I actually have a lot going on today. I'm really just picking up stuff for Troy pretty much while I'm on my little trip, on my trip. I'm only gone for a couple days. I leave Wednesday late afternoon and I come back Saturday morning. So it's just a couple of days. He's basically gonna go with soup and things. You'll actually, you'll see what I pick up in my grocery haul on Saturday. I will film it and have it up for you guys when I'm in Spokane on Saturday. I'm really craving a brown sugar cinnamon shaken espresso. So I think I'm gonna get that. We have a Starbucks in our fries. I think we'll grab a coffee. That'll be my second coffee of the day. I was gonna make a protein coffee, but since I'm gonna be at fries and there's a Starbucks right there. So let's grab some groceries for the week. So I'm still working on my coffee and I'm going to have two of the Alyssa's Oatmeal Bites. You guys know I absolutely love these. This is actually my last container. I need to order some more. You can find these in some stores, especially health food stores. Someone said Publix maybe. I don't have any store near me that carries these so I actually just order them right off of her website. But they have fiber in them. They're gluten-free, non-GMO, high fiber and no sugar added. And they just taste like little oatmeal cookies. And I usually buy six or eight packages, whatever I have to buy to get free shipping and they're just a really good snack nice and healthy also makes a great dessert because like I said they're kind of like an oatmeal quick cookie so I'm going to have a couple of these that'll tide me over until lunch so as promised we're gonna try the new real good chicken nuggets that I got in my last grocery haul I've never tried these I've actually never seen them I saw them them on the Walmart app when I did my grocery pickup these are the Parmesan Garlic. So I love real good chicken strips, nuggets. I love all of them. So excited for these. So four ounces is 120 calories, 21 grams of protein. I'm going to throw these into my air fryer, get them nice and crispy. They smell really good. Wow, they smell really good. You can see that they are super seasoned. Ooh, I'm excited for those. And then I've got this salad kit I need to eat up. It's actually starting to turn, so I'm gonna pick through there and find some of the good lettuce. And then I usually do like a third of the dressing, a third of the croutons, a third of the cheese, and we'll top it with the Parmesan nuggets. So let me put together the salad, pop these in the air fryer. We'll taste test them together. I'm so excited to try them. Oh, and once one of you commented on my grocery haul and said that they have General Sow, so General So nuggets as well. So if you can find those, let me know if they're good. If you've tried them, I'll be on the lookout for them, but I'm so excited to try these. Alrighty, so here's my lunch. These nuggets, they look and smell so good. Again, I did a third of the dressing, third of the cheese, third of the croutons, and then one four ounce serving of the nuggets. Let's try it. I'm beyond excited for these. Yes, a hundred times yes. They are really good. They have a really good garlic Parmesan flavor. It definitely comes through. They taste very different than the traditional nuggets. Wow, those are so good. Man, I hope they bring them to Costco or Sam's Club so you can buy them in bulk. They're really, really, really good. All right, as promised, let me tell you about everything I picked up off of Amazon. All of the pieces that I picked are from the online brand off of Amazon called Icor. Now, I purchased from this brand before. Actually, when I did my Amazon try-on haul with all of the summer clothes, there was a few pieces from the brand. I really like the brand. They have nice quality pieces. First, let's talk about the other items I picked up. I got two pairs of pajamas and another shirt. It's actually the same shirt in a different color because it comes in a two-pack, which is amazing. And then I'll tell you about the outfit that I'm wearing. So the first pair of pajamas, that I picked up are these. These are so cute. They're pink. They're kind of a silky type of material with lace detail and stripes. 
And then they come with this super cute tank top with, again, the lace detail and the stripes. It does have fully adjustable straps. So this is the women's soft sleepwear two-piece set. It actually comes in multiple colors from sizes small through extra, extra large. I picked mine up in a size large and it fits me really well. I could size down to a medium, especially in the shorts. The shorts are pretty loose on me, but I like my pajamas to be a little bit oversized, a little bit more on the comfy side. So I really like this. And again, I picked mine up in the color rose. I don't own any pink pajamas. So I had to grab these really nice quality. Second pair of pajamas. I like these even better. I actually really love these. It's this cute floral print and I picked mine up in navy in a size large. And again, they fit me a little oversized as pajamas should. I really like the length of both of the shorts. They're not too short. They're not too long. These are more of a cotton material with a adjustable drawstring waist. And I actually really love the cute little tank top with that strappy design in navy. So this two-piece set is the sleeveless sleepwear razorback set. It comes in so many colors, floral, solid prints. It also is in sizes small through extra, extra large. And again, I picked mine up in a size large Love it. This is my favorite out of the two, but they're both extremely nice quality. And I love that you can pick these up right off of Amazon. I also wanted to quickly show you that is how the brand is spelt. So I'll link all my pieces down below, but you can also look up this brand directly on Amazon and shop in their store. I will link to the store directly if you want to see everything that the brand carries. And then the top that I'm wearing comes in a two piece set. You can pick so many color combinations. I knew that I wanted black and then I really liked this kind Kind of teal green color. This is so cute. It has a strappy design to it. It is a silk material, so it's very flowy on the body. Camouflages things really well. Sometimes silk can stick to unwelcomed areas, but these are so flowy and flattering on the figure, and you get a set of two. These are the silk satin camisole tank top set. A single one, or like I did, a two pack in sizes small, 3XL. So extremely size, in, size inclusive. These are so soft, like a really good quality silk. Love them, love this teal color, love the black. I think the black pair is so cute with my skirt. I really love my skirt. I love skirts with built-in shorts. It makes it so easy and convenient. You can wear them for athletic purposes or just day-to-day -day wear. This is the women's golf skirt or tennis skirt or gym skirt or day-to-day -day skirt. It comes in about 30 different colors, multiple patterns, stripes, polka dots, solid colors, in sizes, extra small through extra, extra large. I picked mine up in royal blue in a size large. I could size down to a medium. It is pretty loose in the waist, but it's really, really comfortable. And the length of this is really nice. It's not super short. A lot of the built-in skirts can be really short. And this one is the perfect length. For reference, I am 5'8 and about 186 pounds. And this lengthwise of this skirt, perfection. It's extremely nice quality. And like I said, I love a good short built into my skirt. Everything I picked up, again, I will link each piece down below for you. I will link directly to the Amazon store if you want to shop it, but really affordable prices and extremely nice quality. And I'm digging my outfit of the day. So we have some exciting news. We're moving. So we're not moving out of Arizona. We're actually staying in Arizona, but we're moving out of our current home. We live in a town, you guys know we live about eight miles from Green Valley, which is where my in-laws live. So we're moving to Green Valley. But what's exciting is we just bought a lot. So you have to buy the lot because we're doing a new build. Our lot has a view of the mountains, which is exactly what we wanted. We wanted to live in Green Valley when we first moved to Arizona, but we didn't know that you could live there under 55. And luckily we're able to move to this area under the age of 55. So we bought our view lot. We have design for our new house coming up the beginning of August. So we're building from the ground up. Uh, we've picked our floor plan out and we kind of have an idea what we want to do to the inside. So our plan is to take you guys along with us. There'll probably be several videos, kind of the beginning stages of building a new house. It'll be helpful for anybody who's thinking about that. And then we'll probably do a video as the house goes up and then we'll do a final video when it's finished as we're moving in, kind of like we did when we moved here. So we're really excited. We just wanted to wait to share with you until we had a definitive answer on financing. And we've actually already been through pre-qualification, so through an underwriter, which is better than just someone looking it over and going, oh yeah, you're approved. So we've been through a longer process. So yeah. We're really excited. It's going to be our dream house. It's everything we want, the place where we want, the view we want. And then because it's new, we get to pick all the finishes and 
Yeah, by yeah. the beginning of the year, January, February. Uh, six, seven months, I just to build it. So. Six, seven months, we'll this be in our house. Yeah. yeah, we're very excited. This is what we want. This is what we wanted when we moved here. Just at that time, wasn't really feasible for us, and now we're in a better position. You guys know Troy got his Social Security, his pension. Finally, I've shared that with you guys. So we're just in a position now to really build what we want and live really where we want to live. So the dogs are very excited. Lola, oh, Palmer's down here, you can't see them, but they're very excited too because they're gonna have a big yard. It's gonna be amazing. So we'll take you guys along with us. So we just wanted to share, let you know that we're moving. Just so you know, this is what's happening when we're trying to tell you we're moving. <laughs> Actually, I will say Lola was kind of minding her own business, but she is rolling around and then somebody has to go start a fight and he makes such a mess. He kicks the blanket off. He puts the dog bed out in the middle of the room. Get him, Lola. Lola, get Palmer. Yeah, she looks so mean. Get it. So Troy and I are running to Lowe's to look for something for our new house. And I stopped and got a Frosty. This is the little mini of their special Frosty for summer, Triple Berry. It's really good. I'm getting full. I probably won't eat the whole thing, but it's really good. Troy got a couple chicken sandwiches from Arby. We're at Lowe's and we're just gonna look at appliances check price of flooring but we're mainly here for light fixtures one hour later so we just drove by our property that we purchased for our new build house we wanted to see how the neighbor was coming along and they've actually framed everything and then there was a house a couple down from us that's our same floor plan that's maybe like 50 or 60 percent done so we walked through that and that was good because we were able to figure out upgrades we want and upgrades we don't want and i'm glad we did it because there are certain things we thought maybe we would want it to upgrade that when we saw it in real life we're like no we're not gonna spend our money on that and then there were other things that we decided we wanted so i guess it was kind of a double-edged sword but we walked through that saw our property i'm feeling really really good about things it's gonna be a long six seven months while the house is being built because we're so excited about it that we're ready and then we just have to wait for everything but good things come to those who wait so with that being said i'm having another snack i'm hungry so i'm gonna have a built bar i always carry a built bar in my purse because it makes it easy to have something snack healthy snack with protein. This is the raspberry built bar. It's 140 calories, 17 grams of protein. So this is going to be my afternoon snack. We're actually at the gas station getting Troy a pop. And then this will also tide me over until dinner. So for dinner tonight, I'm actually making ramen noodle beef teriyaki. I am out of green onions. I actually bought three stocks and I use them all. So I don't have the green onions. That's the only thing I'm omitting. You just sprinkle those on top. But let me show you what's in the ramen. This is going to be super easy. So you need some ginger, fresh ginger, minced ginger, powder ginger, whatever you have is fine. I have the squeezy ginger, minced garlic, teriyaki sauce. I bought the sweet baby rays, no sugar added. That's going to really save calories and points and carbs in this recipe. And then you need two packs of ramen noodles. You're only using the noodles. So go ahead and discard the flavor packet. A pound of 96% ground beef and some onion. So to a big skillet, everything's eventually going to end up in the skillet. So make sure you get a really good sized one. I added my pound of ground beef and my diced up onion. And then I'm going to get my water coming to a boil for my ramen noodles. We're also going to add in our ginger and a big scoop of minced garlic and let your meat brown completely, your onions cook through. Once your meat is cooked, your onions are cooked, we're adding three quarters of a cup of teriyaki. Mix that in and my noodles are just about done. I'm going to drain them and then we'll add them to the skillet. We're adding in our ramen noodles, stir those in and then just allow them to warm through. So here is dinner. This looks so good. I topped it with some sesame seeds, a little bit of chives. I thought that would give that kind of missing green onion. The recipe makes six servings, so you get quite a big serving. I'll go ahead and put points, calories, macros here on the screen for you. So for dessert tonight, I'm finally going to eat that Wonder Bar that I got in my nutrition haul. It's that little, let me show you guys, it's that little like, chocolate kind of peanut butter bar. So it's 100 calories, one gram of sugar, eight grams of protein. So supposedly it's supposed to be kind of like peanut butter fudge. I'm actually really excited to try this out. I wanted to save it and try it with you guys. So let's take the first bite of it, but this is going to be my dessert. Again, this is the Wonder Bar, 100 calories, eight grams of protein, peanut butter cup protein dessert. Ooh, this looks really good. It smells just like a Reese's. Mm, it's really thick. Mmm. 10 out of 10. This literally tastes like a Reese's peanut butter cup. 
And look at how thick it is. Like it is a thick mama, 100 calories, eight grams of protein. Mm, so good. Again, I got this off of Nutrition. I am 100% buying more. You do have to keep it refrigerated. I do have a 10% discount for Nutrition. I'll link it. Grab the Wonder Bars. That is a wrap on today's What I Eat in a Day. I hope you enjoyed coming along with us. I hope you're excited like we are for our new house. I can't wait to take you guys with me every step of the way. I want you to know exactly what we're going through building a new house because I know that that is kind of like when I vlogged my surgery in Tijuana, my plastic surgery. People really like it. It's one of the most popular videos on my channel. So I wanna make sure that you know every step of the process. So I'm really excited and I'm even more excited to have you guys right along with us. So if you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, check out the description box down below. Definitely get those macros and calories, discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. You can keep up with me a little bit more day-to-day -day as well. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.